Signore e signori, bentornati sul canale di De Daniele Siamo con Metal Gear Solid Episodio 7 se non sbaglio Abbiamo appena abbattuto L'Harrier con dentro Solid Snake Che però vabbè non è morto Non si è salvato e abbiamo visto invece Vamp Camminare sulle acque E dirigersi dove dobbiamo andare noi Quindi promesso che ci avremo lo scontro con Vamp A brevissimo, intanto dobbiamo riuscire A raggiungere la struttura Quest'altra, Shell 2 Perché a quanto pare il presidente si trova lì dentro Per farlo a quanto pare Bisogna fare un po' di zigzaghetto eh, Soprattutto Qui sopra queste strutture Ora ecco, io inizierei proprio No, non farei questo Ragazzuoli mi raccomando tantissimo Tantissimi like, eh, mi raccomando, iscrivetevi e attivate la campanella Se siete nuovi, benvenuti in famiglia Dai che siamo avanti con Metal Gear Solid 2 Sono troppo, troppo, troppo curioso Possiamo lasciarci cadere qua, presumo? Perfetto Ora, io recupererei la bella razioncina che stava qui E eh, che fai? La lasci qui, per forza E mi appropri in cuore Stavano... Ah, attenzione! Qua ci stanno le scacazzate di... Di piccioni Bisogna stare attenti qua ragazzi Maledetti Maledetti Ok ce l'abbiamo fatta Zitti Allora No vai Perché non si arrampica su Io a prendere quella roba là oh. eh, Non ci va No Quindi forse Vabbè bisogna fare il giro Eh vabbè però eh, siete un po' infami però eh Siete un po' infami Siete un po' infami Siete un po' infami Perché non mi potete fare così eh Cioè E che stiamo a fare qua? E che stiamo a fare? Eh no eh No vabbè te prego Ti prego Ti prego Vabbè Va bene è successo niente ragazzi Noi li facciamo con calma Ci facciamo una bella corsa Adesso Ci sta E questo è comunque è così ma eh il suo trial and error, ragazzi, non si smentisce mai. Non si smentisce mai. Allora, calpi, 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 calpi. Ok, questa non la lascio proprio qua. Mai, 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 poi mai. Attenzione. Pensa a fare una speedrun qua. Me coglions. Vai, corsa, corsa, corsa. Eh, non mi interessa, non mi interessa, non mi interessa. Pausa, pausa, pausa. Via. Vado? Perfetto Vabbè ci siamo Me lascio cascava Ok Fermi tutti Fermi tutti Ah Ma qua stiamo Ah capito Sì vabbè Ma lo prendiamo da qui? Eh no, questi se ne accorgono se gli sparo Se ne accorgono Poi si sono girati, hai visto? Perché non, perché non muore? Eh Perfetto Perfetto, ho consumato un botto dei colpi però Zitti, zitti. E calla. Ma dai. Ah, c'è pure il drone. Ma va, va. Ma va, va. Ma vai, va. Ma vai, va. Eh vabbè, ho capito, ho capito. Eh Jack. Da qui! Eh ma che infamoni però. Vabbè, ci vediamo dopo, raga. Famo così, famo. Facciamo così, facciamo. Bene, ragazzi, calmi, calmi. Mo. 
Non ci sta nessuno dei due Siamo tranquilli Siamo tranquilli ragazzi Con calma Vai Perfetto Eh per forza Bisognava far così ragazzi Era già la terza volta che cascavo di sotto Che mi beccavano Quindi non mi sembrava il caso Ok Io però eh, voglio, voglio andare in quella struttura Maledizione Attenzione Attenzione Non è che quasi Non è che casca qualcosa qua Lo sapevo Lo sapevo E mo? E mo? Oh santo cielo Aspetta Sì. Ma, ma la posso fare tutta, ce la faccio? Manda. Ma guarda te, ma qua. Niente, si Sì, vabbè. No, non ce la facciamo, raga. Non, non si può fare. Non si può fare purtroppo. Ora arriva un altro tanto. Arriva, eh, arriva un altro, ne arriva un altro, ne arriva un altro. Cioè, voi vi rendete conto? Cioè, ci stiamo rendendo conto. Ma io come faccio a vedere quello? No, vabbè, assurdo. Come fa ricominciare da qua? Ah, beh, almeno questo. Ma perché al contrario? Ma qua come famo? Eh no. Oh god no, Jack. Ah così. Ci si può, si può anche fare abbassati. Va bene, non lo sapevo. Scusate, scusate. Che ti fanno giusto vedere un attimo da che artista stai a cascare. Perfetto. Ok. Qua ci vogliamo. Non mi fido, ragazzi. Ma scommette che qua se noi beccavamo la pipì lui diceva qualcosa tipo Dio sento un rumore sotto Ci cioè, scommetto guarda Ok Ecco là Scusate ma Eh io voglio tornare là dietro Voglio tornare Noi adesso stiamo qui Esatto Mmm Va chiuso Non si può entrare infatti Uh Corri un po' Ma qua sta Qua è chiuso Fatemi salvare un attimo intanto raga Iniziamo a salvare Sentiamo pure che ci dice Rose Tanto vabbè Gi Già posso immaginare che ci dice Rose Qualche problema esistenziale dei suoi Now that I think about it It feels kind of fresh What does? 
Before, I could always rest assured that I'd see you again. Now it's different. Now it feels like every word we say to each other counts. <laughs> That's great. We could make this into a book and sell it. Want to improve communication in your relationship? Send your man off to fight a war. Jack. Rose, you know my life's at stake here. So is mine. Rose? I'm sorry, but I'm really worried too. I can't help but feel like I'm fighting this battle along with you. Yeah, I know. Thanks. Bah, pensavo peggio. Sentiamo un po' il colonnello che ci dice. The enemy has already entered the nuclear launch code. Secure the president before they can confirm and finalize the code input. The president is on the first floor of Shell 2's core. Ok, ma è chiusa la sigillata la situazione. Snake. Right. You cover the president. Make contact with him before the confirmation of the nuclear launch code. We are going to start repairs on the Kamov. That should keep our hands full for a while. I did a round of Shell 2 during bomb disposal. Let me know if you have any questions. Eh, niente. Mr. X non risponde. Vabbè. A posto. Vabbè, 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 vabbè. Quindi qua non possiamo fare nulla. Uh, vediamo un po'. Che possiamo fare qui? Ah, beh, certo, possiamo andare, ah, dobbiamo andare lì. Certo. Vabbè, qui una chaff grenade mi sembra il minimo, no, ragazzi? Mi sembra il minimo una chaff. Uh, ok. E come lo saltiamo lì? Vabbè, la, la lancio, proviamo, proviamo un attimo. E come facciamo qui? No, non si può fare Non si può fare Qua pure One eternity later Cioè, credo, non ci credo raga, non ci posso credere Non ci posso credere, sono due ore che sto qua Meno male che ho fatto fuori tutti quelli là Meno male che ho fatto fuori tutti i droni là Maledetti 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 Uff, ci siamo Siamo nelle scelle due ragazzi Yeshodela. My father had some unfinished business with him. Olga, calm yourself. Personal feelings. Then screw your plan. I've been waiting for this day for two years, and I will send him to the bottom of the ocean, right next to my old man. Ma stiamo troppo vicini qua. Damn it. Where is also at? Not here. I don't trust him. Don't talk that way about one of your own. He's not one of my own. He left my father to die, remember? Olga, we'll talk later. We need to get started on the final checks for the unit. All right. I'm headed back there. The upper connecting bridge to show is down. What about the chopper? The cam off is out of action. Take the oil fence from strut L. I'll tell my men to start pulling out. Not yet. Their retrieval comes last. The intruder's still at large. Snake. What about the other man? Lock on his side, certainly. He survived that explosion. Listen, Olga, the code confirmation is in one hour. Keep the president alive until then. I know. No one gets in here. Turn the currents on. Of course. L'alta tensione. Ci mancava. The door stays shut unless the president manages to take out that circuit panel from inside the room. And it's no job for bare hands. All right. Come back immediately. One more thing. What? 
We leave for Russia when this business is done. I want half the money for that. Of course. That was part of the agreement. We start living for ourselves after this. If there's anyone, stay here. I want you to take good care of them. Gladly. Gerlukovich soldiers are the cream of the crop. It's time they went free. What happened to rebuilding Mother Russia? The old man is dead. The world is a different place now. It's your life. Just as a reminder, I'm going to say this again, one last time. Don't try anything on us. The feeling is mutual. Okay, okay. I'm in front of the room where they're keeping the president. Everything all right? No sign of flooding, but I can't get close to the door. The floor is electrified. Don't the floor is lava. It. You'll be bacon. Any yeah, suggestions? Remember the Shadow Moses VR training. Take out the circuit panel? Right. But there's no way into the room. Try ventilation ducts. Yeah, I think I see one. Look for a remote control missile launcher. You can guide it through the duct into e the room. Abbiamo. Then target the circuit panel. Got it. Right. But make sure you don't hit the president. Eh, the president is wired with nanomachines. If we know the frequency, I can raise him. We've tried that repeatedly, but there's no response. It looks like the walls have a built-in radio shield. Okay. So that's why Ames lost contact with him. If you need to confirm his position, you can log into the node. Understood. Locate a remote control missile launcher first. Non ce l'abbiamo già, non è l'RGB? Eh ragazzi, eccoci di nuovo all'azione. Il pavimento è elettrificato da quella parte. Vediamo un po' ragazzi, andiamo qua sotto. Nikita! Il Nikita, certo. Ma è Nikita questo Ma se faccio così Ah no c'è cioè colpi Raga, c'è troppa tensione. M4 abbiamo preso. Come l'M4? Uh, ma stiamo pieni di roba, raga. Stiamo pieni di roba, fermi tutti. Buono, buono, buono. Dobbiamo trovare il nodo. Eccolo. Sì, sì. Il nodo ce l'abbiamo, dai. Perfetto La salvata la vogliamo dare, raga? Una salvata la darei, sapete? Però ho visto un condotto prima dell'aria, ragazzi Ho visto un condotto dell'aria Questo è il pavimento elettrificato, ok. Dove l'ho visto il condotto dell'aria? L'ho visto da queste parti. Sono sicuro, eh? Eccolo. Ah, da qui. Dobbiamo farlo entrare. Ah, ok, non possiamo entrare noi. Ok, ok. 
Ok Vabbè allora mo do una salvata E andiamo nell'ascensore Ok È arrivato? Perfetto Salviamo Sì Uh, che è successo? E che è successo? Dai, B1 troviamo il Nikita, meno male, dai E qua non c'è più per nodo Sta fatica per niente, oh Uh, ecco qua Shhh, Zitti, zitti, zitti Zitti, 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 zitti Tutte le volte sta cosa tocca fa Ok, a posto ma qua è bagnato Questi barattoli Colonel, B1 is completely flooded from what I can see. You'll have to swim through. I'm fine with swimming. When you're on the surface, you can swim in corresponding directions using the up, down, left and right movement of the left stick. Push the punch button to dive down from the surface. Okay. Stroke the water and move forward by pushing the punch button. Push it in rapid succession to swim faster. Okay. Change your heading with the left stick. Up will take you up, down takes you lower. Left and right to face those directions. Okay. The O2 gauge will appear under your life gauge while you're underwater. The gauge a proposito la, la webcam ragazzi. Ora well, sposto. The gauge falls to zero. The life gauge will start to drop. You need to be aware of that. Ok. Ok. Andiamo via di qua, scusate, andiamo via di qua, madonna quanto è scomodo ragazzi. E mo, mo va capito di anna qua si sì, vabbè al labirinto Eh mo va capito di anna qua Boom boss Abbiamo preso il Nikita Abbiamo preso il Nikita Abbiamo finito Now head for the first floor of the Shell 2 core Take out the power source and make contact with the president Before the launch code can be reconfirmed Ok Hurry. Come faccio a tornare in superficie? Sì. Uh. Ok. Calma. E qua? Era troppo bello per essere vero, eh? Era troppo bello per essere vero. Calmi, calmi, c'è la mappa, non ho visto il radar. Ma vai a quel paese, va. Vai a quel paese. Lo fa così, per forza. Cioè, è possibile che adesso non riesco più a trovare la porta d'uscita, raga? Qua. Sì, è qua. Sì. No. Eccola, eccola. Sì. Sì. Ce l'abbiamo fatta, ragazzi. Ce l'abbiamo fatta. Perfetto Ci siamo Mo capirà con Nikita le risate ragazzi Che ci facciamo adesso con Nikita 
Le risate Le risate che ci facciamo Allora innanzitutto Prendiamo tutti i proiettili che abbiamo visto in giro Perché mo ci abbiamo di tutto e di più Ok Allora erano qua in fondo i proiettili di Nikita No l'avevamo già presi Ne erano quelli di Nikita Qua per la sì Ok per 10 Perfetto Qui c'era qualcosa Controlliamo bene tutto Non ci facciamo sfuggire in nulla ragazzi Perché tutto estremamente importante Bene, bene, è giunta l'ora ragazzi Di fare bordello È giunta l'ora di fare bordello Nikita Non ce la posso vedere Come scendo giù? Così ginocchio perfetto ok non so dove sta la strada ragazzi non so dove stiamo andando non ne ho idea non ne ho idea non ne ho la più pallida idea ragazzi sto a far giro beh. sto a far giro non ti preoccupare, non è successo. Beh, vai che ce l'hanno da di 20.000 testi Nikita. Meno male, guarda. Andiamo a sinistra, va. Qua è, perfetto. Ci siamo. Vai piano. Che cos'è? Sicuro nel settore sud ovest Quadretto di distribuzione con calma Quindi Cos'è Prez? Presidente, presi, presidente, presidente, si tolga Quindi? Ok, mi ho tolto, le, eh, mi ho tolto la corrente, certo Mi ho tolto la corrente Certo, mi ho tolto la corrente President Johnson. Huh? <sighs> so you're finally here. You've been expecting me? Your equipment, that skull suit, isn't exactly standard military issue. Are you all right, sir? Is this some kind of sick joke? I thought you came to kill me. What? I'm prepared to face the consequences of my betrayal. What are you... Oh. Hmm. What the... You're a man? Hm. Well, who are you? Ma ci posso credere, sir. Foxhound? I see. Now things are starting to make a little sense. <laughs> Pazzito. Switch over to nano communication so nobody can listen in. Yes, sir. A 2 metri stanno di distanza. Vabbè. Do you read me, sir? Uh, yes. Mr. President, it's my understanding that the terrorists have managed to input the code sequence necessary for launching a nuclear strike. That's correct. I punched the sequence in myself. You're working for them? If you asked me two hours ago, my answer would have been yes. Right now, they're keeping me alive until my vital signs are reconfirmed. They betrayed you? I wouldn't quite put it that way. I wanted power. They sought destruction. But why stoop to terrorism? I wanted absolute power. But you're the president. You have power. No, 
I'm just a figurehead. What? I don't have any control. The real power is in the Patriots' hands. Cioè, da noi? The Patriots? The truth behind this country. I'm not surprised you've never heard of them. Very few are aware of their existence, even among those with code word clearance. Huh? Politics, the military, the economy, they control it all. They even choose who becomes president. Putting it simply, the Patriots rule this country. No. Hmm. Hard to believe, isn't it? But it's the truth. The space defense, income tax reduction, and national missile defense programs. Every policy that's been credited to me was actually done according to their instructions. Space defense was initiated by Congress. That's what the Patriots want the country to believe. It's all a show. Democracy is just a filler for textbooks. Think about it. Do you actually believe that public opinion influences the government? No. This country is shaped and controlled as the Patriots see fit. The people are shown what they want to believe. What you call government is actually a well-staged production aimed at satisfying the public. Huh? Don't look at me like that. I'm legally sane, you know. It's not your sanity that worries me. The Patriots. Even I don't know who the actual members are. Are they financial, political, or military leaders? No one knows who the Patriots really are. Even my instructions come from a cutout. All I've been told is that every key decision is made by a group of 12 men, known as the Wise Men's Committee. Your office? The White House? Merely puppets. Pawns in a game. By pledging my loyalty, an insignificant son of a senator was awarded the presidency. Hmm. Of course, that wasn't the only price I had to pay. What do you mean? Even if a pawn becomes a queen, it is still just a playing piece. I wanted to leave my own mark in history, but my ambitions were... You'll understand someday. I wished to be a member of the Patriots. I wanted to wield the power of a king instead of being an expendable pawn. And that justifies acts of terrorism? Yes. I'd intended to use the new Metal Gear as a bargaining chip. Bargaining chip? But I underestimated Solidus. He actually wants to challenge the Patriots, even if it means the destruction of the world. Ah, what are you saying? Whether you believe it or not, the balance of power rests in the hands of the Patriots. They regulate the country's various interests through controlled presentation, staging a drama that is palatable to the general masses. Can you imagine what would happen if they ceased to function? Picture a massive political vacuum, a space that every power monger will try to fill for their own greedy ends. I'm talking about an unregulated power struggle, panic, civil war, chaos. Like it or not, the Patriots is an organization that must continue to exist. So you changed your mind because you wanted to avoid global chaos. Exactly. When I told Solidus that I wished to prevent disaster, he replied that pawns can never become players. And who is this Solidus? Ah. My predecessor, George Sears. That was the name the public came to know him by. I knew him by his code name, Solidus Snake. He was the third snake, preceded by Solid and Liquid, a survivor of the Les Enfants Terribles project. Neither Solid nor Liquid. He was a well-balanced masterpiece that the Patriots saw fit to entrust with the presidency. However, he fell out of grace with the organization four years ago. When acting on his own, he started an incident. Four years ago? Shadow Moses? That's right. At the time, the DARPA chief, Donald Anderson, together with certain influential parties, initiated the development of Metal Gear Rex and an advanced nuclear warhead. However, this did not fall in line with the Patriots' plans. What's more, Solidus decided on his own to send his most trusted man, Ocela, to provoke Liquid Snake, bringing about the said incident. As a result, he succeeded in obtaining Rex and the data on the warhead. 
But in doing so, he ended up revealing the existence of both Rex and the Genome Army, a blunder that earned him the wrath of the Patriots. Shortly thereafter, Solidus was removed from the presidential office. Okay. I thought he resigned. That's the story given to the general public. Following his resignation, the Patriots selected me, their new pawn for the presidency. But that would mean that the presidential race was... That was quite a show, wasn't it? It was a well-scripted drama staged by the Patriots for the benefit of the public. Even the Democrats and Republicans were dancing to the Patriots' tune. Everything went according to plan, but for one exception. Huh. Following his resignation, Solidus' health was scheduled to fail him, bringing about his untimely death. Capped? Correct. But before the Patriots could execute their plot, Solidus went underground with the help of Ocelot. As he avoided pursuit, Solidus gained control of Dead Cell, winning over Colonel Golukovich's outfit. From there, he bided his time, knowing that his opportunity would soon arrive. What opportunity? The completion of the new Metal Gear project, an opportunity that would even his odds against the Patriots. By stealing the Patriots' most valued project, he would be able to place them in a very uncomfortable position. It's the only chance he has for survival. Once he has the new Metal Gear, he'll declare war against the Patriots. Needless to say, he must be stopped. Metal Gear is already operational. No, not yet. Hmm? What you saw was Metal Gear Ray, hijacked two years ago from the Marines by Ocelot. That was the new Metal Gear. Then where's the new Metal Gear? Right here. What? You're standing in it. To be more precise, this entire Big Shell facility is the new Metal Gear. What'd you say? No, I'm quite serious. The upper structure that you've seen is camouflage, designed to represent an offshore cleanup facility. The main structure extends from the foundation all the way down to the ocean floor. The connecting elevator is located on the B2 floor of the Shell 1 core. Arsenal Gear. That's the code name. Arsenal gear. gear. Arsenal? That's right. Arsenal. We're talking about an impregnable fortress carrying a load of over a couple of thousand missiles, including nuclear warheads, all protected by a horde of mass-produced Metal Gear Ray units. Si, mass-produced. The Ray unit was originally designed for the Marines to be used as a countermeasure against the Metal Gear variations throughout the world. The Patriots had Ray redesigned to protect the new Arsenal gear. So now anti-metal gears are guarding a metal gear. Ironic, isn't it? That's not all. Arsenal gear has full access to the military's tactical network, giving it the ability to exercise absolute control yeah, over our nation's armed forces, uh, not to mention our nuclear armament. In short, Arsenal was created to be the core of our country. What kind of idiotic weapon? Weapon? No, you're not seeing the full picture. Hmm? Arsenal gear is more than just a military tool. It is a means to preserve the world as it is. It will establish a new form of control. The Patriots will use it to keep their place as the country's true rulers. Right now, they feel pressured and threatened. By what? They fear an overabundance of digital information. The world will drown in the coming flood of information, and they along with it. The Arsenal plans include a system to digitally manage the flow of information, making it possible to shape the truth for their own purposes. In short, the Arsenal system is the key to their supremacy. The key? Yes. The GW system is the Patriots' trump card. Arsenal gear will be fully operational when GW is successfully integrated. Once operational, it will be a completely new form of power for the Patriots to wield. I had hoped to seize the project from them so that I would be in a strong bargaining position. Bargain for what? I'd hoped to trade my way into their ranks. But Solidus preferred rebellion. Outer Heaven, his plan to unleash a nuclear blast over the skies of Wall Street to break the Patriots' control over the business community is also a key factor in his offensive effort. Outer Heaven? Listen, there isn't much time. The football served as the key for activating Arsenal gear. I've already input the necessary code sequence. 
it won't be long before GW begins to establish connections with other external systems and Arsenal gear becomes fully operational. Stop them before that happens. That is your role. Bro. You've got to find Emma Emmerich. She's the only Emma one Emmerich. who can stop that thing once it's been... La sorella di Al. Di Al. Emma Emmerich? She's the system programmer for Arsenal Gear. I believe she's somewhere on level B1 in the core of this building. I thought the levels below us were flooded. I'm sure they won't let her die just yet, as she's the only remaining programmer for this project. According to Ocelot, she was being held in a locker room located in the northwest part of level B1. Cut transmission and get moving. This is card 4. It'll give you access all the way to Emma's location. Perfetto. Give this tour when you find her. What is it? A program for disrupting the control functions between GW and Arsenal Gear. Take Emma to the computer room on level B2. Shell one core. She'll know how to load the program into the main system. A virus? That's right. Modeled after Foxdy. A biological weapon designed to selectively eliminate personnel with a specific genetic code. But why do you have it? The Patriots had it engineered as a failsafe. And Ocelot forgot to search me. You've got to hurry. That disc is the only way you're going to stop Arsenal. Well... I've told you everything you need to know. Questo ci sta a fare i comodi suoi, raga, ve lo dico io. There's only one thing that remains to be done. Huh. Now, kill me. What the? Cosa? There's no time to argue. The final check for my vital ID will start any second. If you kill me now, you'll at least prevent the nuclear strike. Cut it out! Uh, do it! That's her role! Uh, oh. No! Do it! That's abusing your right to free speech, Mr. President. Or is it ex-president? The president! Why did you... Alas, my finger must have slipped. Sto cacchio di osi l'ho tonturato di spappolarlo. Boy. Forget him. He did us a favor. Without free will, there is no difference between submission and rebellion. My only real choice is to put an end to this charade. Let me at least have the freedom to end it myself. What are you? Find Emma. Stop Arsenal. This is my last order as your commander in chief. I'm counting on you. Porca miseria ragazzi E il presidente ci ha lasciato Lo posso trasportare Vediamo se c'è stata qualche, eh, qualche cosettina Qualche segreto No, niente Allora, dobbiamo trovare Emma Bene, ma chiamiamo un po' Facciamoci un giro di chiamate però Non risponde il colonnello? Come non risponde il colonnello? Oddio non risponde nessuno Manco Rosa Eeeh. Manco possiamo salvare? Mi manca Rosa ragazzi Ecco Colonel, il presidente è morto Lo vedo Mi sento di sentire questo Lo apriamo Dove andiamo da qui? Your mission was to rescue the president and eliminate the terrorist threat. However, given the recent turn of events, we will honor the president's last directive. You must put a stop to Arsenal gear once and for all. Do you actually think there's any truth to his story about this big shell facility being a front for Arsenal gear? I don't have the security clearance necessary to verify the facts. However, he was the president. I'm sure he knew what he was talking about. Aren't you forgetting that he was part of the terrorist plot? All the more reason why I believe his information is reliable. Huh? 
We're talking about a man who chose to die rather than risk a nuclear holocaust. Thanks to his sacrifice, the Nuclear Launch Authority has shifted to the Vice President, effectively eliminating the terrorist threat. Colonel, when you put it like that, it almost sounds like I should have assassinated the President to eliminate the threat. That was not my intention. I was trying to point out that there is certainly some credibility to the words of a man who chose death to protect the innocent. The Colonel has a point, Jack. What about Thank the information God, huh? he gave me on the Patriots? That's a new one on me. I'll see what I can find out. <sighs> Raiden, we're running out of time. Find Emma. She's supposed to be located on you level B1 in just the core of that one. building you're in, right? <sighs> You've got to find her before Arsenal becomes fully operational. Hurry, Jack. It's up to you to make sure that the President didn't sacrifice his life in vain. Understood. Raiden, out. <laughs> Uh, What's your Colonel? status, Raiden? Snake, the president, he's been assassinated. What? There was nothing I could do. What about the nuclear strike code sequence? He died before his vital ID could be reconfirmed. Then the enemies lost their nuclear strike capability. But that Ocelot guy obviously killed the president on purpose. Why? It doesn't make any sense. They had to know that they couldn't launch the nuke if they killed the president. Maybe there's a way to launch without reconfirming the vital ID. Or maybe they found a more effective weapon within Arsenal gear. You knew about Arsenal gear? Yeah. Why didn't you tell me about it? You never asked. Am Rabbe. I correct in assuming you also know that the Big Shell's a front for the project? You mean, did I know that the Big Shell, a fully functional environmental cleanup facility, was designed to camouflage Arsenal gear? Yeah, I did. It's exactly what the President and Ames described, a massive cover story. The good news is that it hasn't really done much in terms of cleaning up the environment, so we won't have to worry about any toxic gas being released if we have to blow the house down. Right. And when did you find out about all of this? It took a while, but we uncovered the info around the time you took out that mad bomber. There's no doubt that Arsenal gear is being built here. Then it was all set up two years ago, on that day. All of it. Two years ago? What really happened here? I took these photos two years ago. I know these pictures. They were on the news on several websites. If I remember right, the reporters blamed you for sinking the tanker. That's right. Otacon, me, we were used. We'd hoped that by going public with photos of the new Metal Gear, we could persuade the government. At least that was the plan at the time. I've gone through VR training of the tanker mission before. Yeah? Well, I doubt it accurately simulates the events of that mission. I'd infiltrated the dummy tanker to obtain proof that a Metal Gear was under development. Shortly after I made it aboard, an armed group led by Colonel Gerlukovich raided the ship and gained control. Olga and Ocelot were among the raiding party. Yeah, and him. Who are you talking about? A man that was supposed to be dead. Their target was also Metal Gear Ray. But Ocelot eliminated Colonel Gerlukovich and Marine Commander Scott Dolph, and he hijacked Ray. So we betrayed them? I don't know what kind of deal was going down. All I remember is what Ocelot said at the time. Something like, I'm taking it back. Ocelot then sank the tanker, along with the soldiers of the Marine Corps. How did you manage to get out? Otacon managed to have a small boat ready for me. That was the easy part. The tough part was not getting dragged down with a sinking tanker. Small miracle when you think about it. It turned out that the whole thing was a setup to lure us. Photos of Snake, taken by the Cypher, were released to the public. In turn, we became the world's most wanted environmental terrorists. It was definitely a move aimed at putting a stop to our anti-Metal Gear activities. But why did they choose Snake? Since the Shadow Moses incident, Snake became sort of a hero. I think the Patriots weren't too happy about that. You knew about the Patriots? Well, yes, to a certain degree. It seems like everyone knows about them except me. Okay, they didn't choose Snake to be a hero, so they decided to do a smear campaign. I think the Patriots wanted to make an example of him so everybody would think twice before opposing them. That's it! They set all this up just to nail you guys. No, there's more to it than that. 
The Marines Metal Gear Ray project, headed by Commander Dolph, was carried out in opposition to the Navy's Arsenal Gear project. To be more precise, the Patriots considered Metal Gear Ray to be a thorn in their side. Hence, they attacked the dummy tanker and stole Ray. They followed this up with a perfect plan. They immediately sent a fully loaded tanker to the same location and sank it, then set up the facility to camouflage the development of Arsenal gear. And we fell for it. Two more puppets in their show. Colonel Gerlukovich and his daughter Olga? Both fell victim to Ocelot's plot. Was Solidus behind all this? He used Ocelot to get hold of Ray, huh? No. He was underground, keeping a low profile at the time. Then it must be the Patriots. If that's the case, what's Ocelot doing alongside Solidus? Hmm. Forget it. We're wasting time. We can figure this out later. The nuclear strike's been prevented, but Arsenal still has a massive payload of missiles to deal with. Right. If the opposition gets control of those missiles... Raiden, you've got to find Emma. Wait a second. Isn't Emma Emmerich... My sister. What's she doing here? You got me. She's a computer whiz who specializes in neural AI and ultra-variable volume data yeah? analysis using complex logic. How she got involved in weapons development is beyond me. Hmm. Whatever her reasons, we need her in order to stop Arsenal. Raiden, find her. I'm on my way. Ok, così. Mo ci fai salvare? Eh, salviamo perché non si sa mai, ragazzi, eh. Sì, devo salvare i dati. Mo che mi racconti dopo? Vediamo un pochino. Ok. Jack. Ah no, sono sempre stata sola, eh? Mi sento così sola, sola, Rosa. Abbiamo sempre... Non sempre. Cosa vuoi dire? Non hai mai dormito al mio fianco. Ma di cosa stai parlando? Dopo che siamo stati insieme nella mia stanza, tu rimani sveglio tutta la notte e te ne vai via subito. Cioè, questo è il livello, ragazzi, dei, dei, dei dialoghi. Ma ti sembra il momento di parlare di queste cose? Perché, Jack? Perché? Senti, Rosa, sono per mezzo di una missione e io... Perché? Perché non puoi rilassarti quando sei con me? Questa è matta, ragazzi. Questa è matta. Cosa tu metti fuori di testa? Ascolta, la missione, io, perché non ti apri con me? Rose, io non posso. L'unica cosa che volevo era condividere i sogni, passare con te una serata particolare. Volevo solo trovarti al mio fianco a risveglio. E forse chiedere troppo. Io comunque quando finisco la missione la lascio, la lascio. È la notte, la notte mi fa paura. Tu non c'entri, davvero? Hai paura della notte? Ma cosa vuoi dire? Non riesco a rilassarmi quando sono con qualcuno. Jack non mi ha mai lasciato entrare in camera tua. Mi serve privacy, proprio non mi interessa. Non ti interessa? Scusa, scusa, volevo dire che ci sono delle cose che devo tenere per me. Ricordi quella volta che sono riuscito ad entrare nella tua, nella tua stanza? Ci conosciamo ormai da quasi un anno e tu sei esploso. Era la prima volta che alzavi le mani contro di me. Ero così preoccupata per te. Senti, mi dispiace, non era solo la tua natura violenta a terrorizzarmi, era la tua stanza, il tuo cuore. Smettila. Non c'era niente nella stanza, solo un letto e un tavolino. Sembrava la cella di una prigione. Rose, niente televisore, niente foto di famiglia, neanche un poster. Rose, uso quella stanza solo per dormirci. Una stanza senza vita, quasi come il tuo cuore vuoto. Ecco perché avevo cercato di tenerti lontana. Pensavo di cominciare a capirti fino a quando non ho visto quella stanza. Saresti stata più felice se avessi avuto una tua foto appesa alla parete. Non intendevo dire questo. Ora basta, Rose, ne parleremo poi, dopo la missione. Va bene, dopo la missione, capisco. Cioè, ragazzi, è terribile. Cioè, è te i dialoghi tra loro sono terrificanti. Cioè, è... Io sono senza parole. Allora ragazzi, dobbiamo capire. Capiamo un attimo al volo. Mo ci abbiamo la tessera di livello 4 e va bene. Allora, lei sta nella sezione B1 dove stiamo noi. Non credo che questa porta si apra. No. Ha detto nel B1 della struttura dove ci troviamo noi adesso. Quindi, raga, dovremmo prendere l'ascensore, presumo. Presumo. Però era tutto allagato B1 E eh, però ci ha detto che è sta qua O oh no
Raiden, are you reading me? This is Arakan. What's your situation? Sei nell'acqua. Wet and miserable. This place is flooded. The seawater that's been pumped up is pouring into the building. I see. Listen, there's something I have to tell you about EE. -E. Don't worry eh. about her. I'll get her out. She's afraid of water. Ecco. What? Yeah. When she was six years old, she almost drowned with my father in our swimming pool. She can't swim? Well, yes and no. We used to swim a lot together when we were kids. In fact, she swam like a fish until that day when she almost drowned. When the accident happened, I was in my room. I learned later that EE was calling me for help. She didn't doubt for a minute that I'd be there. You could see the pool from my room, but I didn't realize at the time that she needed my help. What were you doing? I... I was... So Emma survived the ordeal? Yeah, but my father didn't. Well, so you blamed yourself and left your family? No. E.E. E. seems to believe that was the case. The fact is, I betrayed her. And you think she can't swim because of the traumatic experience? I haven't seen her since that day, but yes, I think so. I got a letter from Julie, her mother, after they moved back to England. In her letter, she mentioned that E.E. E. couldn't swim anymore, that she refused to even wear a bathing suit. Damn, if she still can't swim, we're in trouble. Level B1 in the core is pretty much flooded. Look, maybe you can help her overcome the trauma. Yeah. Pure psychologo, what do you want? Help her get over it? Well, it's still gonna take some time to repair the cam off. Sorry, kid. Emma's rescue is up to you. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. An underwater mission. Well, this is a first. Look, I'll see what I can do. I suggest that you drum the map of the building into your head, because you won't have time to look at it when you try to bring Emma out. I'm counting on you, Raiden. I covered most of the core when I had to take out the C4s. If there's anything you need to ask me, call me on the codec. I'll do that. <laughs> okay. Raga, fateci giocare, mo basta però a parlare. Io ho la tessera, ragazzi, ma Ho la tessera, ma non, non so come arrivarci da quella parte lì, però. Andiamo un po' di qua. Uh. Calmi ragazzi, ci siamo, ci siamo, ci siamo, stiamo andando bene. Ci sono due porte qua. Ah, questa era chiusa, ma la possiamo. Ah sì, la possiamo aprire. Ok. Prima non ce la facevo aprire. Ok Ci sto a capire niente raga Fermi tu fermi tutti fermi tutti fermi tutti fermi 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 calma 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 Cerchiamo di capire bene cosa fare eh Veloce, 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 veloce. Sì. Bene, ragazzi. Io mi prendo pure la vita. Così certo c'è sta narrazione qua. Perfetto. Ecco che dovevo fare. Scusate. 
Allora ragazzi ho spostato un po' più in basso la webcam perché almeno potete vedere il, la barra della vita Fatemi sapere anche voi nei commenti insomma se, se vi piace così Allora Bene 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 ci siamo ci siamo Uff E calla No, mica ci abbiamo la boss fight adesso, ragazzi, con lui Vi prego Still ticking, huh? Unfortunately, hell had no vacancies Ci stava aspettando qua, lui Sì, vabbè Maledetto, eh. Abbiamo preso. Human muscles are quite eloquent. They speak out clearly what a person's next move would be. They even tell me which way a gun is going to be pointed before the trigger is pulled. But your muscles, they're different. This should be fun. Well worth the wait. Questo mi fa una paura, raga. You knew I was coming? You become a nuisance. I can't let you interfere with Arsenal gear. The girl is just ahead. She is of no use to us now. But she served as well as the live bait for the big catch. Crazy Ivan sometimes speaks the truth. Emma's alive? She was some time ago. But the flooding has become quite serious. I wouldn't be surprised if she's a mermaid now. What? Did you really think killing the president would prevent a nuclear strike? Think again. I didn't do it. <laughs> Arsenal is still armed with a purified hydrogen bomb. Purified hydrogen bomb? This is no ordinary nuclear bomb. This weapon is capable of heavy hydrogen nuclear fusion using lasers and magnetics to generate heat insulated compression. It was a top secret project initiated by the current president, and Solidus has no idea of its existence. The clean thermonuclear bomb is at an experimental stage and is handled differently. Specifically, it becomes launch capable when Arsenal is activated. A nuclear threat still exists. Six months ago, We lost everything we believed in. We were abandoned to take the fall in their cover-up. We were labeled as killers, responsible for the mass murder of civilians, as well as our own allies. And the public believed every word, turning a deaf ear to whatever we had to say to the contrary. Our only goal is to wipe them from the face of the earth and destroy this world of deceit they have created along with them. You're insane. Insane? We might be the only ones telling the truth. Final check for activating Arsenal has been completed. All Arsenal personnel report to your stations. Well, it sounds like Arsenal's ready to go into operation. Damn it! You're still hoping that the girl can install that virus you're carrying around, aren't you? You know? <sighs> It's a shame you're not going to be around long enough to hand her the program. That isn't seawater, you know. It's a byproduct of the microbes contained in the pool. Buoyancy is practically non-existent thanks to the high oxygen content. Once you walk in, you don't come up. Take a good look at your grave. I see. Show me what you've got. Sì, vabbè. Oddio che bella però. Che bella l'effetto dell'acqua. Oddio che tocca fa qua. Ecco, non vedete la vita sì, un po' la vedete, eh. Eh. 
Schon Miss Thailand Schar. Pure la reggisione. Oh, boh, proviamolo però, eh. Scusa, a sto punto. Io lo provo la RGB. Non ci abbiamo manco una mappa per vedere dove sta. Peccato. Peccato. Andiamo de Sogo, ma va, non voglio consumare le armi quelle buone. Certo, devo capire che tipo di boss fight è questa, ragazzi, eh. Questa va capita. che te l'abbiamo preso mm. dobbiamo sentire che miseria ok sta sotto l'acqua Ah, voi non potete vedere raga Vedete c'ha una barretta viola lui Sotto la, la vita Che quando lo colpisco a cazzotti Gli, gli tolgo quella di vita Calmi, calmi. Eh, ma c'è un botto di vita però, eh. Già che ci sto. Pure l'ossigeno lui c'ha. Che vabbè. Vedete? Eh, il fatto è che però, madonna santa, c'è un botto di vita questo. Uh, alza, ti alza, Dryden. No, così non va bene. No. Alza di Raiden E si è svegliato Calmi, calmi Stiamo a consumare troppe razioni Stiamo a consumare Vai con l'M4 Che bastardo E come lo faccio a evitare così? Eh, troppe razioni ragazzi Da so come va Tosto Tosto ragazzi questo Tosto 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 Beh non riesco più a toglierla così Guarda 
Como lo stunno Calmi Ma solo quando esce fuori dall'acqua riesco a prenderlo Incredibile Mo corro, corro Faccio così, è l'unico modo Via, 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 via Via, 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 via No! Come faccio qua? Come faccio qua? Così devo fare. Ho sbagliato io, vabbè. Fermi, 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 fermi. Siete, siete, siete. Siete, 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 siete. Peccato Sono morto Sono morto Morto Eh Maledetto 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 Non sta succedendo Jack, tu devi rispondere a me Jack No Bryden! Sì. sì Ragazzi Ragazzi è stato devastante Ragazzi è stato devastante Mori Mori
per sempre Colonel, they've apparently completed the final check procedure for Arsenal gear. Find Emma on the double. You've got to get her to install the virus program that the president okay. gave you. Ok, ce l'abbiamo qua dietro? Take her to the computer room on level B2 in the core of shell 1. Capirai, shell 1. Did you catch all that? I didn't make it on time. Arsenal's going active. Yeah, I heard. The hostage rescue's gonna have to wait. I'm going after Emma. We'll secure the computer room. Looks like we can't install the virus program without Emma. Can't your partner do it? I would if I could. But the security for this system is no joke. I need more time. That's why we need her. Understood. I'll make sure you have your family. Okay, se ci sbrighiamo, ragazzi, magari, eh. What's up? A lot of years have passed between Ma chi se ne frega, ma ne parlate her, dopo. Right? I don't have the right to see her. We can talk about this later. Raiden, I think dai, you get moving. Emma's eh, in the eh dai, the ma lui che c'ha un po' di buon senso è è Snake, cavolo. Ok. Bene. Ok, quindi Emma si dovrebbe trovare qui. Jack, is that So io, so io. Um, Jack about trying to break into your room. Rose, just forget about it. No, listen to me. I said I did it because I was worried about you, but it wasn't just that. What? I was suspicious. I thought there might be someone else. Someone else? Another woman. Non ci posso Rose. credere, raga. Non ci posso credere che stava assistendo a questa conversazione. Because sometimes you're so horribly cold. You know I wouldn't. I'm serious. Sometimes I feel like you're pushing me away. So I Did you get in? Yeah. Are you satisfied now? There wasn't anyone there, was there? No. No, there was no one there. There was absolutely no one in your room. Not another woman, not me. So me lo fa apposta così, ma comunque per fatti nervosi, lo fa, lo fa apposta, dai. I just wanted to apologize, that's all. Talk to you later. Mamma mia, ragazzi. Beh, pare che Emma la dovremmo salvare la prossima volta ragazzi Oggi abbiamo scoperto un fottio di roba e è successo di tutto e di più È morto pure il presidente Adesso ci serve Emma per disinnescare questo, questo Metal Gear Insomma, per, per il disco che ci ha dato il presidente per farlo installare Credo sia una sorta di virus eh, che agisce sui soldati che hanno un codice genetico di un certo tipo Una sorta di Fox Die, no? Presumo eh, però questa non sa nuotà la sorella di Emerick quindi adesso dobbiamo vedere cosa dobbiamo fare ma lo scopriremo nel prossimo episodio con calma ragazzi abbiamo buttato giù pure Vamp il che non è poco è stata una battaglia raga infernale poi ho tagliato ma ho fatto delle morti assurde neanche ve lo sto di guarda e nulla ragazzuoli lasciate tantissimi like iscrivetevi attivate la campanella se siete nuovi mi raccomando benvenuti in famiglia e noi nulla ragazzi ci vediamo alla prossima mamma mia mamma mia si va sempre più in profondità ragazzi, mo tocca prendere questa e portarla a Shell 1, cari dai.